Hey everyone, it's Monique Brown from MotorCityMyC.com, the arsenal for beauty, wellness, and feminine allure. And I want to talk to you today about positioning. There's a woman that I've been courting, uh, courting through email that I met uh, maybe a couple months ago. Um, she's a she's a co-founder and CEO for a big IT company here in um, St. Louis, actually. And I met her through I met her through an executive luncheon uh, through the United Way. So that's why I always encourage young ladies to get involved and to attend different type of networking, you know, functions. So, um, when I, I'm looking at this lady, she's a bomb, she's a white woman too, uh, just in case you all need a visual, if that matters for some of you. But anyway, she's a fairly young woman. I don't even know if she's 40 yet. She may be in her early 40s. Four children, she just had, she just had another um, baby not too long ago, and the woman is looking good. You know, as a young woman, I don't, I don't have any children yet. I'm not married yet, but I admire women who have children who are, who are running businesses, who have families, and it's like no sweat for them. I can learn something from you know a woman like that. So we're in the meeting, and I'm listening to her story. I'm checking her out. She has her good jewelry on. Her clothes are impeccable. She looks great, right? So I'm sitting there, and I and I feel like I'm connected to her already, just based upon her story, and. Um, it's just a small group. It was an executive luncheon, so it's just a small group of us who, I guess, were invited to attend if you opt in, if you're on time to opt in. And so I'm listening to her story, and she's just talking about how she built this company from the ground up. She went on an inkling, and um, she made it happen. She really followed her gut, and she made it happen. When people asked her, well, how do you balance it all? She's like, you know, well, I don't worry about it. She has four children, four children and it's not... To her, to her children are not a um, a burden you know they're fun they keep you young and vibrant and you know how do you plan and, and keep it all going in together and she's just like you know what I don't plan I just do and when she said that I said oh my gosh this woman is me this woman is me because that's exactly what I say I always just do I don't have any plan I just do what needs to be done and then I sort of course correct along the way oftentimes it works out sometimes eh, maybe it's best to plan but when I, when I don't, when I heard her say that, I was like, okay, I have to really get to know this woman. And what I mean by positioning specifically is that I need to, I need to be under her. I need to know who she knows. I need to have, I need to have access to her circle, to whatever she has access to. I need to get, I need to be up under her so that I can have that sort of access too. And so, um, at the end of the discussion, you know, when you, you go out and people say, um, hey, you exchange business cards and they say, well, make sure you call me. My advice is that make sure you call them. People are serious about, um, they're serious about that. You know, if they say, hey, call me, make sure that you call them. And sometimes you may come to a point where people are not so serious, but for the most part, people are willing to help. And so I followed up with her and, um, the first time she didn't respond and, you know, she's a busy woman. She didn't respond. And I, I think the title of my email was, I think you used to be me in your past life. And, uh, <laughs> So the second time I sent her an email, she responded like, hey, Monique, I'm glad you followed up with me, blah, 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 this is great, this is good, boom. So what's interesting, I say this because um, what's interesting is that I, I saw a position that I really wanted um, from her company, and I, um, when she sent me that email, she CC'd like one of the director of operations, and she CC'd someone else, and I started to connect with the person with whom she CC'd me on so that, you know, I can build relationships with that person too. And um, when the position came up, you know, it's a position, I think, in Minneapolis, actually. And so when it came up, I said, hey, I CC'd the person that she, I CC'd her contact. And then ultimately, to make a long story short, whoever the recruiter was or whoever that person was in Minneapolis was like, hey, yeah, I got your email. I got your resume from several higher ups. What can I do for you? What can I do? What can I do? And I'm like, OK, this is how I was working. So when I talk about positioning, this is you might be asking, OK, well, what does this mean? What do you want? Well, when Miss CEO lady has her big fancy smancy wine parties and dinner parties at her big mansion, I want to be invited. I want access to that. So, you know, I feel like women, the only way that you can be better is by is by reading more and by surrounding yourselves with good people, great people and, and good people and good books. Right. Um, and so. When she has access, that means that I can come back to you all. I can come back to my tribe and whatever I've learned from her, I can come back and teach it to, to my people. So everything is cyclical and I just wanted to say that because it's so important to position yourself. I want to know when she's having a dinner party or whatever event, if she's, you know, if she's the leader for some big event, 
and by my emailing her every week with some random emails, you know, making sure they're substantive, making sure I know that she likes to read. So I'll send her maybe a free PDF of a book that I've read that I thought that, you know, she might like, or I'll send her a link to um, an article that I think that she might be interested in. Sometimes she'll respond and sometimes she doesn't, but guess what? She's going to be thinking about me because I'm in her inbox every week. And when, um, when it comes time for me to say, hey, this is, you know, this is what I like from you. I want, I want you to mentor me. Then she'll be like, hey, we have built up a sense of rapport, although it's mostly my emailing her, but it's all good, though. Um, so I'm just really excited. I'm just really excited about what the future holds, and I'm just really excited about meeting great people who are willing to help and willing to share their information. So I hope that, you know, I hope that you can do the same. You find people, you get out, you get involved, and you find people with whom you can connect and that people who are who can really serve as a catalyst and propel you to the next level of where you need to be in life. Um, and if you haven't found that person, then I just invite you to join my community. You can subscribe to the Moxie Manifesto. You can click the link below. Um, and just opt in. It's your weekly to-do tactics to help you be good, to look good, and to do better. So I'm signing out. Peace. <laughs>